Today, we're going to learn how to create this logo reveal animation in Filmora. Hey everyone, welcome to Filmora MVP YouTube channel. Here we teach you editing tricks, filmmaking, and camera techniques. So make sure you're subscribed to our channel and also hit the notification bell to get updates on our new videos. Before we start editing, click the download link in the description box. Click on the free download option. Now, a Filmora installer is downloaded automatically. Just double click on it, agree with the terms, and here you go. Filmora started to download and install. Once it's installed, it'll start and run automatically. First of all, go to File, Project Settings. Under Resolution, we change the frame rate to 60 FPS. Next, drop the default title to the timeline. Double click to Advanced Panel, delete the existing text. Then click here to find the circle shape, look on the left side. Here we disable Fill and Shape Border. Then change the color of the circle to white and decrease its size to a small dot. Now go back to the main editing window, click here and add 9 more tracks on the timeline. Let's duplicate the text to 5 tracks. Next, select those 5 new titles and move to the 45th frame. Drag 6th default title by 25 frame and stop at 1 second and 5th frame. After that, decrease the duration of videos on the 1st to 5th layer and end at 2 seconds position. Double click on 1st default title, under Animation tab, add a keyframe at the beginning. Change the scale to 0. Then go to the 20th frame, change the scale to 150. Move on to the 30th frame, change the scale back to 100. Check out the preview. Then we can see the bounce revealing animation of this small circle. First, let's hide the 1st and 6th layer. Then add a keyframe on the second title. Change its position X to left so we move it out of the frame. Then select the 3rd layer, change its position X to right until it's out of the frame. Select 4th layer, change its position Y to the top until it moves out of the frame. And select 5th layer, change its position Y to the bottom and move it out of the frame. OK, now go to 1 second and 10th frame. Select the 2nd layer. Change position X to negative 20. Then select the 3rd title. Change its position X to 20. Select the 4th title. Change position Y to 20 and select the 5th title. Change its position Y to negative 20. Double click on 6th title to open the advanced panel. Extend the dot in the center. Go back to main editing window, select 6th title, add an animation keyframe at 1 second and 5th frame, change the scale to 0. After that, go to the 1 second and 35th frame, change the scale to 125. Then change the scale to 100 on 1 second and 50th frames. You can also create a reverse keyframing animation at the end. OK, add a new default title on 1 second and 35th frames and change its ending duration on 4 seconds and 45th frames. Double click on the default title. Change the text color to black and type your word inside the circle. On the left, enable the shadow option. Change distance to 0, blur to 20, and opacity to 60. On the left, go to the animation tab and choose any animation according to your liking. Here we pick Up Dir Insert Animation. What's more, we can also add anything you like. Here we're going to the Elements tab, searching for Fashion Modern Elements, and using this Element 39. In last, go to the Transition tab, search for Pixels In, and add it to the beginning of the elements. Double click on the transition, and change the duration to 1 second. Last but not least, let's add Dissolve Transition at the end of Elements, again changing its duration to 1 second. So we are finally done! Thank you for watching! If you like this video, then give this video a thumbs up! 
Plus, subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon, but don't leave without sharing this video and leave your comment below. Bye!